Welcome back to the Paranormal Review, and today we're going to review a video called Odd Creature Filmed at Barrington Quarry in Western Australia. And this description says, filmed this the other week, only wish I had more memory on my phone. Zoomed in, version, and slow by half. Okay. Um, now, this isn't the actual first video that they've uploaded. As you can see, this video has 7,851 views. The actual first video that they uploaded is this one. Uploaded... March 31st, 2016, 162 views, Odd Creature Filmed at Barrington Quarry in Western Australia. Now, let me just point out the suspiciousness of that. They uploaded this four days previous to the second video, got 162 views, or probably less than that, and decided, well, it's not getting enough views, we're going to upload a second version. That's suspicious to me, meaning that they're just kind of view fishing. Now, if you notice in the past, when I get send-ins and stuff, I will sometimes post the original send-in, then I'll do a slow down and enhanced version, and then I'll do my review and, and, and upload those. But that's because I want to give you, I want to give you guys the option to watch the original footage. I want to give you guys an enhanced zoomed in version without my commentaries, and then I and then I do a commentary version where I where I put everything up. Also, in all my reviews, I put the original link to the in to the video in the description. So if you don't want to hear me ramble on about what I think it is and my observations, you can just watch the original footage and not have to listen to me talk the whole time so if you're one of those people click in the original link instead of complaining in the comments they, for me to stop pausing it okay anyways let's just get on with that's kind of suspicious to me that four days later he puts up a slowed down version instead of right at the same time if, if you notice in my videos i always upload them all at the same time and it's for your convenience okay i don't care if i get views or not it's it's, it's nice and it helps me uh continue doing what i do but it's just you know for my content and i like to put them up in this case Going from 162 views to 1, 000, no, 7,851 is a big increase, and that's kind of suspicious. Anyways, the second thing that's suspicious about this video is, let's just, let's just, let's just start with the criteria, okay? Why are they filming, okay? Let's, let's watch this video real quick and get on with it. So this is the zoomed out regular version they uploaded first. And if you watch down here, the creature's going to walk down here, and it's going to appear in this crevice. Right there. Okay, you can't hear what they're saying. They're whispering. It's too windy. You can't understand what they're saying. I'm not sure what language they're speaking or or what, but there's no there's no way you can tell what they're saying, even if it is English. Okay, so um, I want to know why they're filming in the first place. There's no creature walking up here on the ridge and then crossing down and walking down the hill and then disappearing for a few minutes and then reappearing in this gap there's nothing there's no reason for the new filming i mean yeah it is pretty scenery but is it worth filming okay i don't see anything re i don't see anything really worth filming here other than they're gonna about to have a bigfoot sighting which how would they know that because they can't see it up here before they're filming okay and they didn't say that in the description i mean it's possible that they did but they didn't say in the description we saw a bigfoot walking on this ridge it disappeared and that's when we turned the camera on and that you know that would make more sense to me okay now let's watch the zoomed in version and slow down this is where we can see the actual creature. So I've already critiqued why they're filming. There's no reason for them to be filming. So that's suspicious to me to begin with. Okay, now let's actually look at the creature. The best shot we get of this creature is actually right here. All right. It looks really skinny to me. It doesn't look extremely tall. But you know what? Bigfoots, we don't really know if they're tall. We don't know really know if they're small. We don't know if they're skinny. We don't know if they're fat. There's many different Bigfoots sightings. There's many different accounts. And people... We don't have one to study, so we can't say, well, Bigfoots are always this tall or this small. And, of course, Bigfoots, you know, would, would would be born and then grow up, so it could be a juvenile. But we don't know anything about Bigfoot, really, except for, you know, hearsay and what people have observed. But we don't really know exactly what Bigfoots look like, do. We don't know how their arms thing really is, how their, big their strides really are. We don't know. So we can't really say, okay, well, this is for sure, for sure not a Bigfoot, based on those things, because we don't have anything to study. We don't have... You know, zoologists studying them. We don't have any of them in captivity or being able to scientifically observe to say, okay, well, Bigfoot for sure does this and this. You know, some people say, well, Bigfoots have seven foot strides or five foot strides or four feet strides. Some people say that they have bigger, smaller strides. They have arm swing. We don't know. The fact is, we don't know. But this creature itself, we don't have anything to compare it to. We don't have any other, you know, we don't have anything over here that's a known height, like a stop sign, for example, or a tree that has been taking pictures afterwards and measured. We don't have anything that we can measure this against to really say, okay, well, how big is this creature? So as far as the actual creature goes, it, it, it's a dark figure. 
far away, filmed on a blurry, non not very focused in camera. So we don't we can't really say anything much about the, about the creature, whether it's fake or whether it's real. We don't know because there's nothing to compare it to, and it's not a really high definition. Okay, so it just kind of appears through this gap, walks over here, just quickly kneels on the ground, and then I'm assuming that's where the camera died, and they're going to reach out the video. Okay, so then it comes out again. This is kneels down, crouches there, and then guess what? Camera memory, they run out of camera memory. Okay, now this brings me to the third or fourth suspicious thing about this video um, is the reason why it stops filming. Okay, as you guys know, when I critique videos, the things that I look for most are why they start filming, the actual creature itself, and then why they stopped filming. Now, why did they stop filming? Well, in this case, it's an easy excuse. My camera ran out of battery, uh, memory card. Okay, sometimes it's ran out of battery. Sometimes it's ran out of memory card. Sometimes it's it's the creature ran away. Sometimes it's we tried to follow the creature, or sometimes it's we got too scared and we ran away. Okay, we just got to decide which one of those is credible and which one's more realistic. And my camera ran out of batteries, or my camera ran out of memory, is a very good excuse. Not, I mean, the battery would it would have been a much much better choice for them because if you run out of batteries, you can't do anything about it. They should have an extra battery, right? In this case, if they ran out of phone memory on their phone, they very could have easily quickly gone back into a couple other videos previously and deleted, you know, previous pictures or previous videos and then restarted started refilming this creature. However, they did not do that. They just said, okay, well, my phone's out of memory. Let's continue on and not film anymore, right? It sounds like there's also two people there, so why couldn't the second person also be filming or using their camera when this guy's memory card got full? So that, to me, makes it very suspicious. It seems to me this is just a very, very, very easy way for them to get out of a, an exit plan. Okay, There always has to be an exit plan in a hoax, okay? Because you don't just stop randomly. You don't just start filming a Bigfoot and go, okay, well, we're done filming this Bigfoot. It's Bigfoot. No one has proof. No one has evidence. You're not going to stop filming Bigfoot. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Anyway, I'm going to say this one is probably definitely just their friend in a dark pants, dark sweater, hoodie, mask, some Bigfoot suit, monkey suit, something like that. It's too far away to really tell what it is for sure. You can't see, you know, costume folds or something like that. Um, but... You know, the fact, that the, let's go back to the main facts, okay? They uploaded one video, didn't get very many views. They uploaded it again four or five days later, got a, a decent amount more views. That's suspicious to me, okay? Why didn't they just upload both versions of the same day, okay? Uh, the second thing is, why did they start filming in the first place? As we have seen, there's no creature up here walking, you know, in the beginning of the film and then disappearing back down here and then coming back out of this crevice. There's no reason for them to be filming. They didn't say in the description, well, we saw a creature walking on this ridge, and then it went back and back in here, and we kept filming, and it appeared in this crevice. No, they didn't, or this gap, whatever, you know. They didn't say anything. They, they, it just starts filming nothing, and then all of a sudden there's a creature. The reaction is not very, they're not like, oh my gosh, a Bigfoot. They're, or, oh, what is that? Is it a bear? Is it, you know, something, you know. It, there's no reaction whatsoever to whatever that thing is. I mean, if I was just out here on a peaceful day filming, and then all of a sudden there was some guy over here, big, I mean, maybe they just thought it was a guy. Uh, and, then, and then that maybe that explains there's no reaction but if they think it's just a guy why all of a sudden is it an odd creature you know what I'm saying do they get home and go hey let's make sure, let's, let's, let's try to make that guy seem like a weird creature but no it's behavior is not like that the behavior, behavior walks out here crouches down it is, it's obviously doing something weird it's not just a guy out here hiking right so that, that's suspicious okay the, set, the other thing is, is it's too far away you can't really compare it to so that's really not conclusive it's not really suspicious it's just not very conclusive the, the the most suspicious thing to me is the reason why it's this thing stops getting filmed which is my ca the camera suddenly died okay that why didn't you delete videos why didn't you delete pictures and refilm why isn't your friend that you can hear talking in the beginning with you filming also or filming after at least after your camera memory dies and what happened after this okay wh what's in the description nothing nothing anyways guys i'm gonna have to say this was definitely a hoax and uh, until next time please subscribe send me your footage if you want me to review it um i definitely believe that bigfoot is out there that he's real i just think that you know 95 percent to 99 percent of these videos are definitely hoaxes uh 100 of them are inconclusive because until we have you know, some DNA evidence or a body, we're not going to be really 100% sure to confirm it. But like, like we said in our episode two or three of my uh, uh, commentaries, we can...
prove things exist by overwhelming sightings and experiences. So I think there's definitely something out there, but we don't have 100% conclusive proof. It's all circumstantial at this point or, you know, experiences of other people's. Anyways, until next time, please subscribe, comment, like, share, and uh, give me your footage if you want me to review it. And uh, I really hope to see some real stuff out here. And uh, we'll talk to you guys later. Thanks a lot.